Uh, now, the paper suggests that some of the UAP, or unidentified aerial phenomena, that we've been seeing, especially those captured by NASA's cameras in space, might not be what we think. They're not little green men in flying saucers. They might actually be these complex structures of plasma or plasmoids. They move in ways that defy uh, our understanding of physics, uh, changing direction like they're playing dodgeball in zero gravity, and they seem to interact with each other and with human technology in ways that suggest there's more going on than just random energy. Now, from a Christian perspective, this is where it gets real. These plasmoids, if they are sentient, or even if they're just behaving in ways that mimic sentience, could be seen as part of that spiritual realm that we talk about in Scripture. Uh, think about it. Ephesians 6.12 talks about our struggle not being against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of darkness of this world. So could these plasmoids be a modern manifestation of those spiritual forces? Uh, they're not flesh and blood. They're energy. But they're interacting with our world in ways that could be deceptive or miraculous, depending who you talk to. Um, people see the, these things and they create religions out of this.